So this is how it's set up. Uh, there, this one actually has a, a first, second, third, third slot. The first slot is for some leaders and all. Because it gotta travel a long distance to dissolve the CO2. The second is for in between, and then the third one is for 20 to 30 liters, which is mine, so I will be using that. And it's already hooked there. I don't know if you can see that, but it's already hooked there. And with a tube, and it goes into a uh, air well, so the so anything so the water can't really uh, travel back into the CO2 system. So I added sugar, yeast, and a stabilizer that came with the package. And you can see that it's actually working right now. So we'll put the cap on and get it ready. My CO2 has been running for 24 hours now. It takes a while for the CO2 bubble to show up. Because it's got a bit of pressure inside the bottle. But once it does, it really helps. Uh, right now, you can see that there's a bubble inside that's about to come out. And after a while, you get pretty good uh, bubble per second or per minute. But now I won't get like, I've just started, so it's just like one bubble per 80 so minutes. There you go. Um, what it does is the CO2 bubble dissolves into the water slowly, but you have to do this leather ladder here and the plants take in the CO2 that's in the water and once the bubble here reaches the top it will just disperse into the air and it will just repeat that as for as long as the chemical reaction and your system is still in effect 